Hey everyone, it's Adam with UploadWP.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to set up the uh, Canvas theme business page template image slider. Alright, so what we're currently looking at is the home page of our demo site, ocecilia.com, and we've been building this site with the Canvas theme from start to finish. Um, the home page is currently set to a magazine style layout, as you can see here. But I want to focus today on the business page template. Specifically, I want to focus in on the image slider for the business page template. So let's get started by logging into the WordPress admin. The first thing you need to do is create um, a page for the, the business template. In this case, I've already created it, so I'm just going to go ahead and click Edit and show you how it's set up. Uh, you can title the page whatever you want. To keep it simple for this tutorial, I just called it Business. Uh, but the key thing is you need to uh, set this template to business. All right, so select business from the drop down right here under the page, page attributes widget, template, and then select business and publish the page. Okay, so once that page has been published, uh, if you, you'll go out to the site and you'll see that if you after you refresh the page, it'll be here, but there's nothing there once you go to the page. It's just a blank page for right now. All right, so now let's let's go ahead and add our featured image slider to this business page. To do that we need to go back into the WordPress admin and we need to go to uh, Canvas and then Theme Options and on the Theme Options page scroll down to Business Template and then click on Featured Slider and then just make sure to check this Featured Slider uh, box here set the number of slides, in this case I'm going to go with 3, you can go all the way up to 19 if you want um, and then you can set uh, or work, tweak all these other settings if you'd, if you'd like. Uh, for the purpose of this video, I'm going to skip over the uh, details of that, but play around with the with the other settings uh, until you get what you want. Click Save Changes. And now that we've enabled the featured slider, the next thing is we need to go ahead and go to Slides and then Add Slide Pages. So we'll click on Slide Pages. Right now you'll see there's no slide pages here, so I'm going to go ahead and create one called Business. And then add new slide page. Alright, so our business slide page has been created. And now I need to add my slide. Add new. And I've already created three slides. Uh, I used Photoshop to create them. The dimensions, uh, I believe, are 980 by 320 or yeah, 980 by 350. Um, so here's the first one right here, uh, here's the second one, and here's the third one. Alright, so you can create those in any image editing software. I like to use Photoshop, but you could use uh, GIMP uh, as well. GIMP is an open source free image editing software that would get the job done as well. Uh, but I'm just going to go ahead and create my first slide here. I'm just going to say um, Biz page template slide one, and I'm going to go ahead right here on the right hand side under slide pages widget. I'm going to select business, and that shows up because that's the business slide page that we set up. And then I'm going to scroll down and I'm just going to go ahead and upload that first slide. Okay, after it's uploaded, I'm just going to say <coughs> use this image. can see it load right there so then go ahead and just publish it and repeat the process for each of your slides in this case I have two more to do so I'll go ahead and do the exact same thing I'm just gonna click on add new call this biz page slide uh, 2 I'm gonna scroll down to the right hand side right here slide pages I'm gonna select business and then I'm going to upload the slide. All right, and I'm going to say use this image and publish that slide. And I'm going to do the same the same thing now for the third slide. Just click add new and biz page slide three. You can title the slides whatever you want. It doesn't really matter. Um, I'll go ahead and select your slide pages, in this case it's business, and then I'm going to scroll down and upload the slide. Okay, go ahead and click on use this image. 
and publish the slide. Okay, so then if we go out to the site and we go to the business page and refresh the page, we sh should see the uh, image slider show up. And there we go, there's the image slider for the business page template. Uh, so you can go ahead and tweak the settings for the actual slider um, as far as if you wanted to have a text overlay uh, on the left hand side here or, or the speed at which the slides go. You can tweak all of that by going into the canvas theme options and then business template featured slider settings right here. This is where you would uh, tweak that. If you wanted to display the title of the slide, you could do that by checking the box here. Um, so play around with that until you uh, have it set up exactly how you want. So in the next Canvas Theme tutorial video, we're going to stick with the business page template. And I'm going to show you how to uh, modify or how to um, control the layout of the uh, business page template as far as the content goes uh, and format it using WooTheme short codes. Um, and tweak the right hand sidebar or even eliminate it if we wanted to so it looks more like a traditional um, like a traditional business site home page um, and if you wanted to set that uh, the business page template to the home page you could do that by just going to settings and then reading and setting the uh, static home page to business uh, which we'll cover in the next video so thanks for watching this one for more Canvas theme tutorials, check out uploadwp.com. My name is Adam. See you in the next video.